So guys, uh, yeah, Fortnite just dropped uh, Chapter 2 OG, and it's not what I expected at all, because I'll show you this right now, alright? Yeah, this is the first red flag, first of all, because this is obviously, I mean, we knew that Snoop Dogg was going to come in, like, December, but why is he here now? This is November, because he has become, essentially, the face of Chap- Wait a minute, did I say- Capitulo Dos Remake. Oh, crap. I picked it. I did the Spanish version. Whoops. But anyway, guys, what I was saying is that, yeah, this is not Midas, but if you want to see what they did to Midas, we still got a Midas skin. And, oh, my God, what did they do? It's very cool, though. So, we got our boy, 8 Ball, but he's now one ball, which I think is really cool, because, like, they took my boy, and they actually, like, changed his skin around a little bit, did him some justice, gave him a clean as heck redesign, which I already, I still, I'm gonna be rocking the old eight ball skin, and the old Maya skin, and, wait, is that, I didn't even notice that before, that's female chaos agent, which I think is actually pretty cool. They actually took these two skins from Chapter 2 Season 1, big skins, right? And they sort of incorporated them back into the main spy theme of this. Because it looks like this is going to be half half of this season alone, I think, is going to be just Chapter 2 Season 2 theme. Because the first week, I'm not sure exactly if the agents... Oh, you'll see what they do with the agency pretty soon. Uh, if you haven't seen it already, it is atrocious. I will show it later. Because look, look, it's just... That's cool, right? As you can see here, they took my boy Midas. They made him really jacked. Like, if you don't look at the cat head, just look at the body. Just forget he has a cat head for a second. Just look at the body, all right? They made my boy jacked as heck. And then they put Meowsel's head on him. It, it doesn't look that good. I'm going to be honest with you. These two characters, as two, I rock both of these characters, like, a lot. Particularly Midas, because, you know, he's the goat. But, like... When you combine them together, it's like combining... God, how do I say this? Uh, okay, chicken wings and ice cream, right? If you were to combine chicken wings and ice cream, like, okay, there's maybe some vegetarians in the chat, but it's like combining two different things that just are good, perfectly good by themselves. Like a bicycle and a gaming setup. Like... It's fine, because you get to, like, ride your bicycle, right? And then you get to go to your gaming setup. But if you combine them together, it creates an abomination. Thing, it just doesn't work. Like, it's not efficient at what it's supposed to be. Like, Meowth's was cool because it was, you know, like a cat skin. It was funny. It was, uh, you know, mostly whatever. It was a clean designed skin. It represented Fortnite as a brand. And we had Midas, right? Midas was just cool, right? You know, clean the face of Chapter 2 Season 2. Basically the face of Chapter 2 at this point. Always has been. Always will be. And just a really cool skin as well. Perhaps even cooler than Meowsel's. Yes, definitely cooler than Meowsel's. I mean, it's not like Meowsel wasn't a cool skin, but might as Oh my god. Arguably top three coolest skins in all of Fortnite history. And they take those two and they put them together to make this. Like... I know I'm ranting, but if you guys, I know some of you all, you guys didn't play back in the day, but I remember the day that Chapter 2 Season 2 came out. I was a lot younger back then, but I remember it very, very well. I can remember when Chapter 2 released. I can remember when all these seasons first came out, so I can for sure, like, say that what they have done here, I'm glad that they tried to bring it back, but I, I feel like they're going just too far down the rabbit hole, because at least with 49 OG, they took Omega, and they took Ragnarok, and that was actually a cool looking skin because it was like taking a, a car and a gaming setup and mixing it together. Because you can have like a gaming setup in the passenger seat or something, right? But if you're taking like something that doesn't work, like a lawnmower and uh, a Beyblade, 
okay, I know that's a really bad example, but like, let's say like a bicycle helmet and a can of gasoline, right? Like those are two perfectly fine items, but once you start mixing things that we like together, like it can be done tastefully and at the same time, it can be done god awful. And this right here, I'm going to actually say, hot take, this is ass. So, although, that's not even right there. It's not directly the right there. You can see they got checked for two. One for one rep, uh, one for two reps. And this, on the other hand, this was the third thing. Just look at it. And just think about it. Look at it for 10 seconds. And then 10 seconds come back to me. Actually, I'm not going to even give you 10 seconds. Because you don't even need 10 seconds to process how much... What, what did they do? Like, as you can see, Snoop Dogg is the new faction on the Fortnite Island. Because first, Ghost took this place over. I mean, they built the agency. And Shadow built their own authority, which was like the, which was the agency, but, like, Shadow. And now Snoop Dogg? It's, it just feels wrong. Because I know that some Fortnite collabs work really well. Like, for example, we just had a Fortnite Marvel season. And that was great because for, because Marvel was all about, you know, like superheroes and fighting. And Fortnite was all about, you know, fast-paced action. So it actually worked really well. And we they had Marvel collabs for a long time. So not only do you take a brand that is very... Not only do you take something... I, I'm not... By the way, this is not a knock on Snoop Dogg. I think Snoop Dogg is insanely cool. And this sort of aesthetic is cool by itself. But like I said, when you take two things that don't work very well together and you start mixing them, I understand, like, if you just take this image by itself, it looks sick. But, and, but, this is the agency. This was Fortnite's big thing. You know, Ghost and Midas. And they massacred my boy. They straight up massacred my boy. Like, you cannot do Midas more dirty than this. Like, are you serious? Like, at least, like, it just looks uncanny for some reason. I don't know. Maybe it's just the eyes or maybe maybe it's just the fact that Midas is a human being. I mean, also, that's a freaking cat. There are two things that are fine by themselves when you mix them together. It just looks really weird. All right. Wait a minute. Because if you see here, this is fine. Right, on its own, this is, I understand that that cat is still there, but like, if you were to take all the context away from this, it's fine, it's cool. But once you start realizing that this is ch supposed to be chapter two, then that's where I have a problem because I understand the whole remixing and all that, but I feel like they took the concept a little bit too far, frankly, because if you look at it, it, well, you see, it looks enough like season two, where you know this is season two, but at the same time, there are just the, the details are just so unbelievably off putting that you just start to not really appreciate what they did here. Because look at it, and look at chapter two, season two, like. I mean, I honestly have not even seen what the internet said about any of this, because this stuff just came out. But, like, hey. <laughs> I'm I, All I'm saying is that it, it's probably not going to be that good. I can guarantee you, right, I'm not seeing anything that the internet has said, but I'm going to... You can take my word that there... That, at least some people out there are, are going to say that this, that this is not the best way to do it. Now, I understand that, you know, Chapter 2 is great, you know, but then, then there's those people out there like, oh, you can't just, you know, bring back, like, oh, bring back Chapter 2, and then there's other people who are like, oh, no, just, just you're like, oh, just bring back Chapter 2, like, like, what the hell's wrong with you? And then there's me in the middle, where I feel like there was a way they could have done this, but they straight up massacred my boy. This, this is a, this is personal, me personally, because Midas was my favorite skin for a long time, and still kind of is, because I kind of stuck rocking burn on, I'm going to be honest with you. I mean, I still rock that skin a lot, but Midas, damn, Midas is like my top favorite skin in my locker right now. So, the fact that they did my boy this dirty, this dirty, like, personally, I'm not a fan. 
Had this been Brutus? Okay, fine. Had this been... Actually, wait a minute. It was just Meow Souls, Brutus, and Midas. Those are the only male characters in that one battle pass. But, and hear me out on this, we had plenty of other skins in other battle passes that they could have used it. We could have had Ripley in Midas. That would have looked insanely cool. Because that actually kind of works. And they took Ripley and Ripley made him go and put a suit on him. I mean, you can tell that it's not Midas enough for it to be Midas. Because this looks way too much like Midas for me to be feel comfortable around it. Like, they just took his head off and put it on a cat head, which is just strange. But they could have done this differently. Anyway, it's not my game. I'm, ex- I'm still excited to play this season. I'm going to give it a chance. But until then, thank you for watching. This far, it's been 10 minutes and 50 seconds of me ranting. Make sure you like and subscribe, by the way. And I will see you in the next one. Peace.